Okay, so um, I kind of need my wireless card from the new computer and the old computer again because I'm putting the old computer downstairs and, you know, to listen to some music downstairs. Um, so, and it, you know, doesn't already have an integrated wireless card. Don't ask me why I put locks on these computers because just nobody knows. I just put them there for, yeah. Maybe I might be able, if I need a lock, I'll know where it is. On the back of the computer. There you go. Alright, seriously. Don't give me this BS. And the other one needs a screwdriver, which is conveniently located right here. Let me move this out of the way. So that's the inside of the old crappy one. You notice how they use these wires now, or the old ones. And this was for hard drive. Now they have these wires going throughout this computer. All over the place in this computer. <sighs> but I don't like how it opens. I like how the old one opens, because it's pretty cool. And they don't cool the processors like they do with the old one either. Because you can tell under that green thing right there, this lifts up, is the cooling fins for the uh, processor. So let me continue taking this off. Okay, and before doing any work inside a computer, you need to ground yourself, so just use a screw on the outlet or whatever, because one shock to the circuit board or motherboard, fire can get it. Alright, so now that you can see in here, I'm taking, oh I need another screwdriver, really. Which one is this wireless card? Oh, this one. Oh, this one has two wireless cards in it also. Just to, ow! Let you know. Alright, so here's the Linksys wireless card. And I don't know where the little thing is that goes in here. Oh, crap. I wonder if I can steal it from over here. This thing is surprisingly dust free for how long? Or it's because it's over a year old, so. It's. And I haven't cleaned in it or done anything inside, but yet it's. There's hardly any dust on these fan blades. It's remarkable, because this thing used to have so much dust in it. Oh lord, I had to blow that out with a compressor every so often. Alright, so now that I got it out of here, um, here, if anybody wants to see how they use these cables right here, these are in place of the old giant cable things, my diggers. This thing has two fans, one fan here, one fan on the uh, four processors, and one fan for the uh, power unit. Here's the hard drive, the two disk drives, uh, memory, PCI bus, uh, that's pretty much all you need to know. Because that's just the main junk to a computer. So, you know, there's not much, but that circuit board has a lot of crap on it. And this one, which weighs a ton, um, is, this one actually has a nice, really nice video card, because this one only has regular, um, the blue one, which is RGB, or RV, or VGA, um, and it's integrated into the system. But this card is separate from the rest, but um, they didn't used to have integrated wireless uh, video cards. They used to be separate like this. But this actually has a digital out, an S video out, and the regular monitor out. 
the R uh, VGA or R V G whatever and it has its own 52 or 54 kilobyte uh, modem dial up modem and it has a whole bunch of USB ports compared to the, this one which only has four on the back and this one has um, one less jack than that one does for sound but this thing used to be really nice but there's no way you can speed this thing up because it only has one processor so where did I put that card? Seriously? Did I just lose? <laughs> I lost the damn card. Here uh, oh, I found it. Uh, and yes the software is already installed on this computer and that computer and that computer is going to start bit, uh, bitching at me when I plug it in. It's going to be where the freak is my damn card? But it already has an integrated um, card but it's for wireless and which we don't have. And then you just close that. Kidding me? Close you. And no, 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 piece of shit. Alright, there we go. So that's in, and here's the antenna, which goes on the back, so I can get viruses and crap because this thing this old computer doesn't really have an upgraded uh, uh, it has McAfee on it but it's the subscriptions all effed up and oh lord oh crap I think it was a ton mm. Okay, just slides back together, put the little thumb screwy things back in. Like so. But before you start working in a computer, you need to ground yourself to something because if you don't, one shock will break in. You won't have a computer anymore, let's just put it that way. It'll fry your motherboard and without no motherboard, you don't got a computer. Blah, and as you can, see, if you can see right here, there's the slot for the uh, other wireless card, which is wireless N, and we have wireless G, which aren't, which don't work together because it's only a wireless G, and it doesn't work with wireless, or it's only wireless N, and it doesn't work with wireless G. I was like, what, what, what's wrong with that? But it's got a full-time connection right here, so it should be fine um, and work good. But, and what the f and things but you got to see inside the computer and you know, I already did the I did talk about this one so if you want to go ahead and watch that video you can go ahead and do that I like how I have this cover panel because it hides all the CD-ROM and crap inside this thing stays cool all the time. It's, this computer's like on 24/7, and it stays cool. So ah, that's good because computers don't like heat. Well, you no, know, no electronics likes heat. So just keep electronics away from heat. Don't shock it or ground yourself before you work inside your computer. Um, and make sure you follow the directions if you're installing something like inside the computer. Don't just go ahead and think you know what you're doing because you might not. You might mess it up and. You put such a great investment into your computer, so you don't want to mess it up, so... <sighs> yep, alright, so... I was just changing the wireless card out. Uh, not too good of a video, but I'm running out of things to do, so... But anyway, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Um, and watch the other channels. I mean, channels. Videos on my channel. And... Yeah. So... Thanks again.